Yes, we are back. Back again in Fernbus, back again to do another trip. Uh, and this time back in somewhere we haven't been for a very long time. And that's right up the top of the map here at Albeck. All the way up up, up there. That's all the way at the, the top of the map. Uh, we're going to take a trip from here at Albeck uh, to... Uh, I've forgotten. Professional. Uh, to uh, Selin. Uh, then, to, where are we going then? Starting here at Albeck. This is starting well, isn't it? Uh, going to Selin, uh, then going to Rostock, uh, then going to Schwerin, uh, and then going up to Kiel, and finally up to Flensburg. Uh, so a bit of a trip across the top of the map. Uh, and the vehicle of choice for this is the awesome Scania 121 over there. And based on that star, it's going to be one of those. Uh, if you are watching this on the YouTubes, then hello. Uh, this going out on uh, what used to be Firm Bus Friday. Uh, where I used to do this weekly, but then, you know, stopped. Uh, so now this is going out on the Firm Bus Friday because I couldn't think of any other day to put it out. And it's, it rhymes. The, it doesn't rhyme. It's the thing. It's the Firm Bus Friday. That's the thing. That's where it's going out. Uh, other content is some of the OMSIs on a Monday. Uh, Train Sim Classic on a Wednesday. Train Sim World 2 on a Sunday. Uh, and if I've got something new to look at... No, Train Sim World 2 is on a Saturday. It's going to be one of those, isn't it? Train Sim World 2 is on a Saturday something new if i got to look at words on a sunday yeah okay let's go and check some people in before i get even more confused hang on i haven't logged in uh you're going to sell him we're going there uh you we're going to flensburg i think we're going there oh yeah hang on you want the thing open didn't you there we go i'll open the thing you're gonna get rid of your thing now you're just gonna disappear there we go uh, you're going to sell in. Okay, uh, let's go to you. You. You're going to Flensburg. Yeah, get on. You. Kiel. Am I going to Kiel? I think I'm going to Kiel. I can't remember. I've got it written down and everything as well. Yeah, we are going to Kiel. Uh, Flensburg. Yeah, that's uh, that's definitely a thing. You. Kiel. Yeah, we're still going there. Uh, you down there. Rostock. Uh, we're going there. You. Schwerin, uh, we're going there. You? Yep, sell him. You can get on. You? Kiel. I am bound for your direction. You want to buy a ticket, don't you? Have you not heard of like the internet or anything or a ticket office? I'm guessing those are a thing. But no, just wait and turn up. Just wait to get on board the coach and then you decide to buy one. Uh, hi, Dylan. Hi, Confuse. Uh, you? Yeah, Flensburg. It's quite loud by the side of this road. I've just realised. I tried to turn down the volume for the AI traffic as well. Alf Gates. Gates. Okay. And you. Schwerin. And you. Kiel. Okay. Everybody is on the board. The bus. Coach thing. Co can I shut the... Thank you. Right. Can I remember how to do this then? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard the Sims and Stuff uh, Fixed Bus Travel Service going to... Some noise. Hang on, we'll do that first. I'll, I'll carry on with this in a second. Richard! Uh, thank you very much indeed. Um, supply, subscribe. So, well, I can't do the words today. Uh, subscribe. No, I can't. Still can't do it. Subscribed. Uh, six months. That's almost a fortnight. And then another couple more months and that will indeed be two weeks. Uh, thank you, Richard, for your support. Uh, See, so yeah, hang on, where was I? Oh, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard this Sims and Stuff Flixbus travel service uh, going to uh, Selin, Rostock, Schwerin, Kiel, and Flensburg. Uh, it does say on the side of the coach a bonus to arrive alive. Bonus to arrive alive. Uh, in the seatback pocket in front of you, uh, you will find your next of kin card. If you kindly fill out the details of your next of kin on that card, uh, we'll know who to contact in the, event the in the event of your untimely death on this journey. If you also like to fill out any usernames, credit card numbers, PIN numbers, passwords, etc., we'll make use of those as well. For your convenience, we have already ticked the Sims and Stuff life insurance box, and whatever you do, don't read a small print. Okay. Right, that's done. Like I sort of remember I do this. That does there. That goes there. Press the thing. Start the what's it. Cheesy one. Poppy the thingy into the geary. Do the indicator. 
Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. Auch bei uns im Bus gilt die Gesetz of course using the card. Pflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während Oh yeah, you need to fill out again an. every time. In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut's doch mal auf unserer Facebook Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen, kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, God, that's ugly. euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich oh, wow. aktuelle okay, that's Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß. Oh bei yeah! Drax, Hello, thanks for the follow. Welcome to Flixbus. We're glad to have you on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seat belts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seat belt fastened throughout the entire Come on. journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There's a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. I can't Many see. Our seats are equipped with I've lost the ability to see. Marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Well, it's not very often in doing those announcements that we end up so close to the start point. Because we started, like, there. <laughs> and we've had to go around the block and it's taken a while. But, we are making our way... Oh, someone's got a cough. Covid. Uh, making our way out on our way to Selim. So I may have under-anticipated how long this journey is going to take because I've just seen our arrival time is due at 8.23. This may take a while. I think it might be dark by the time we get to our final destination. I started early as well. started like 6am. That's some flashing of the lights. Oh, someone's getting a phone call. I saw. Right. Finally, we can get a move on towards the selling place. Uh, if you are watching this on the YouTube, there'll be some links in the doobly doo below. Uh, one to where you can get the game. Uh, one to where you can watch this madness live on the Twitchy. Uh, and one to the Discord server as well. So do check those out. Hi, David. So 172k to sell in. I have forgotten how awesome Firm Bus looks. Okay, the Iveco is going to pull out, isn't it? Or is it a transit? It could be a transit. Oh, yeah, you just pull out then. That's That's fine. Oh, it's definitely a COVID cough, that one. A 
And of course, I had to pick the Scania because, uh, well, Scania. That's it. Okay. Uh, please stay green. Please stay green. Please stay green. Please stay green. Aha. We made it. Uh oh. Someone's getting a phone call. Is it me? Nope. They obviously didn't want to speak to that person, did they? They're just like, no, I'm not going to answer that. I'm on. I want a coach. I'm on my way to somewhere. The driver's an idiot. I may not make it. Tell the cat I love her. I filled out an extra kin card. It'll be fine. As I try to pick a route where we don't end up on too much of the uh, motorway, freeway, highway thing. I think there are going to be sections of that. The driver was too busy talking about the passengers. He probably was. So we're due at 8.23. It's currently 6.36. I reckon we'll be ahead of time, actually. Oh, there's, there's some slowing down of the vehicles. Yeah, just fancy doing this today. I've done it in a while. I did the football DLC a while back. Uh, I've done some tourist bus recently. I just thought I'd go and uh, just do a trip in standard firm bus. Just to see if it's still as good as I remembered it being. And so far, yes it is. Okay, a left turn coming up. You can't beat the sound of Scania indicators, can you? You stay there. You stay there. Thank you. That's definitely a COVID cough. Other diseases are available. It'll be a nice time of the day to start a journey. 6 a.m. I was going to start earlier because obviously it's right at like 5 a.m. now. <laughs> right, go, 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 go. Try not to crash into the Mondeo. does just look so good. I just wish, as we said this last time, um, that they pulled their finger out and got a um, an economy system built into this. And multiplayer. Because the map is huge. The map's big enough to accommodate it. That would be really cool. How hard can it be? <laughs> Other endemics are in the offering. Yeah, just pick one. Some of them just require a bit of an ointment, you know, course of antibiotics. May involve some itching. Right, 111k. 
to sell in. Are you going to let me out? No? Okay, no, you're not going to let me out then. Thank you. Lovely Germans. Well, it might not be from Germany. Taken by a Flixbus coach. Right, what well, lane? We've got a, the hazard warningy thing on the on the map. I could sat nav thing. Think of me, what's it? Oh, phone. Phone call for someone. Someone answer the phone. Is it for me? If it's for me, tell I'm not in. Oh, that was a bend. Going for the overtake. Well, good thing I did, actually, because they all just came to a stop. Power station over there, then. Are we actually going to do the overtakey thing, or are we just going to... No, we're just going to sit out here in the middle lane, so I'll go back in then. I bet now I'll have to overtake again because of the lorry. Wait for his car to come past. Oh! Border dash. We've got to come off here. Uh, oh, I see. We've got to come off here. Let me come back on here when we go on to the next place. I'm wondering what the two lines were on the uh, on the sat nav. It's like, uh, what's going on? Why have you got two of the lines? <laughs> Definitely a lot of coffee people on here. That's a view in the distance, isn't it? Couldn't see if anything was coming, so I just pulled out anyway. All right, 60 limit, so I try not to do the speedy thing. Yeah, I did forget how nice it is to drive in firm bus. Okay, that was someone got a text message, or was the WhatsApp, or the the Snappy Chatty, or the the Tiki Toki, or other social media things are available. As long as they didn't get a book face one, if they had a book face one, I just throw them off. Seems to be quite a slow speed for this section of road. 60 of the thingies. Perhaps it's because it's a bit turny. Oh, now we, hang on, so we get an 80 limit just so we come towards the bend. That's logical. Oh dear, that, no, that was a nasty cough. Yeah, we should uh, find the nearest hospital and drop that guy off. Oh, now we got a hundred limit. Yay. It's like a nice new bit of road, this. See ya. Oh, we're going over the bridge. Oh, that's cool. It's very bridgy. I 
like it's a 60, not a 40. Don't you know it to slow down that much. And then we get an 80. With 50 of the Ks to go to the first stop. Oh, that's a nice view. I see, we've got the old... Oh, I'm guessing this is a new bridge then. I must say this last time. I've been over here for ages. So we've got the old bridge, I'm guessing, which has got a railway bridge next to it, and they must have built this new one. I'm sure it's got something similar to this. Perhaps they've used this same bridge thingy somewhere else. Because that's what they're called. They're called bridge thingies. Right, a 120 limit. Well, this thing can't do that. That's just cruel. <laughs> We're limited to the 100 of the things. And 36k. I'm expecting to come off here at some point soon. Power. Well, not when we stop behind these idiots. Doing half the speed limit. Oh, okay. Maybe we didn't come off then. No, put the foot down. Shame you can't just take the limiter off this thing. It'd be interesting to see what it could actually do. Go over the overtake. Oh, there's a barrier. Obviously faster than this, isn't it? Because 100 kilometers an hour is 60 miles an hour. In the UK, they can do 70. So it obviously can go faster. And now we've got an 80. I might as well stay out here. <coughs> we've got to come back down this road to get back to that highway, freeway, dual carriageway, autobahn, motorway road, the, the big road, the fast road. We'll call it that. We should call it the fast road. Oh god, now I go down to a 60, then a 40. That just seems too slow. A speed camera there. Oh, 50. It wasn't 40. Phone. Someone get a phone. Definitely the phone. Yep, yeah, the phone's ringing. I'm going to wait for the AI to sort themselves out. <laughs> if I don't end up with COVID at the end of this trip, I'm going to be really surprised. The light... It is red. Therefore, you shall not pass. So a little scanning a one-to-one -one is what we're in. Looking uh, rather nice. A few passengers on board. Come on, lights. Although we are... Actually, no, we're due at 8.23. It's 8.01. So we're only going to be a few minutes early. 
Um, excuse me. Coming through. Yep, coming through. I can see that. That's some wheels on that, isn't it? It's a lot of overhang past the rear wheel as well, isn't it? It's like... <coughs> oh dear, more coughing. Ow! Hang on! I was parked! You drove into me! Exactly, his fault entirely. Yep, definitely. Okay, left here. You're going to wait there for me, are you? That's really nice of you. Thank you very much. Right, about to arrive at Selin. Oh look, more victims. I mean, passengers. Hang on, there we go. Right, you are first. You're going to Schwerin? Yeah, get on. You? Yeah. Get on. You. Rostock. Yeah, we're going there. Get on. Scary was probably the thing. Flensburg. Yeah, get on. You're wearing that, aren't you? Oh, you just got off. Okay. You're going to Schwerin. Get on. Uh, what? Are you swaying that guy's armpit? What the hell are you doing? Okay. Um, you. Yeah, you're correct. You armpit smeller. Vienna? No, no, no. I'm not going there. Right, close down the thing. Close down the close down close down the thing. Right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard this Sims and Stuff Flixbus Travel Service going to Rostock, Schwerin, Kiel and Flensburg. Uh, on the side of the coach it does say a bonus to arrive alive. Uh, trust me, it probably will be. Uh, in the seatbelt pocket in front of you, you'll find our next of kin card. If you kindly fill out the details of your next of kin on that card, we'll know who to contact in the event of your untimely death on this journey. If you also like to fill out any usernames, credit card numbers, PIN numbers, passwords, etc., we'll make use of those as well. For your convenience, we have already ticked the Simpsons Stuff life insurance box, and whatever you do, don't read the small print. Right, that's done. Sit you down thing, close your door thing. Uh, we're supposed to take a break between here and Rostock. Okay, so we must remember to do that. Okay, and. Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. Auch bei uns im Bus gilt die gesetzliche Anschnallpflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack- und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig. We may be here sometime. Right, in that case. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von oh, exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Sonntagsfahrer. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. 
Hello and Coming through. to Flixbus. Coming through. Landing a seat here. You on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seat belts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seat belt fastened throughout the entire journey. Oh good. In seat pocket in front Eric's of you. fine. You will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There's a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit Flixbox.com no, I think they're new. or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas, and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Yeah, there's certainly been some updates, I think. I'm loving the onboard audio where you've got phones ringing and people getting text messages and coughing and stuff. And yeah, I think there's been some changes to the vehicles as well. There are, you know, the trucks look different. Um, so I've never seen bin lorries before. So I think there have been improvements to this. I'm also doing quite a lot of speeding. So you've got to take a, a break between here and uh, Rostock. So the first place we see to have a pee, we shall stop and have one. Don't forget, for those of you watching live, uh, back tonight at 6 uh, with some farming. Um, tomorrow lunchtime is going to be some MSFS, taking the BAE 146 on a flight from Innsbruck to somewhere. Uh, back to the UK, I think is the plan. Um, and tomorrow night, some Forza Horizon 5 in multiplayer. Saturday lunchtime is going to be some Train Sim World 2 on the Harlem line. Saturday night uh, still to be decided and uh, Sunday lunchtime a uh, look at the mega update for truck and logistics so loads of stuff coming up over the next few days okay so we need to find a P place there's a fuel place up here. But a place to have a PE is what we need. Well, there's one on board. Don't know why I'm still sat behind this lorry now. I could just do the overtakey thing, couldn't I? Yeah, definitely forgotten how well this thing runs and how good it looks considering how bad it was when it first released it has got better and better as I said earlier I just wish there was an economy system for it because that would make it a whole lot more playable All right, you got an 80 back over the bridge went to a 60 as well didn't it or did it stay an 80 might have been a 60 which now means we're going to be left out here in the outside lane oh I did stay 80 yeah they talked about it a couple of years ago about the economy system for this because it was working in uh, the football DLC and obviously it works in tourist bus Obviously, uh, the focus has been consoles and the other stupid game. That's a corner. Okay, so 
Uh, you appear to be driving quite slowly. Good oil since 1984. Was it bad oil before that? Right, 100 limit. Shall overtake now. Once we get some of the powers. Phone. F phone's ringing. Oh, God, this is going to end badly. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. They just don't merge, do they? They can't cope with it. There was some stopping there. Right, we've got to find a place to go pee. Oh, that's going to be a new bit of road going in then. So that's going to be a dynamic update. I love it that they do that. So in an update in the future, that bit of road that's being built there to the right will eventually be incorporated into the game and the traffic will reroute onto that road. I wish more games did that. Put a bit of road in that's being built, and in the next update, film mit und Sandra Bullock auch so oft yeah, in the next update, have it built because that, that's just brilliant. You can see that in the progress in like tourist bus, where there's that uh, draw carriageway heading down to uh, the bottom of the map that it keeps getting longer. That's so cool. Yeah, I think pro mods have, but it's a shame that ETS2 like haven't as a standard thing. You could just have someone working on dynamic updates. You know, put a bit of road in, the next update a month later, extend it, next update, extend it, so people can see a new road being built. That would actually be really cool. Uh, we got to do the lefty turny thing. But we can't turn left because the light is the red colour, which means we cannot do the go thing. I like that transition back into the cab. It is quite cool. Scanning a coach, scanning a truck. Come on, lights. Surely we can do the go thing. And we can. So we do at Rostock at 11.12. It's currently 9.07. <coughs> Definitely a COVID cough. Go, 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 go. Right, we need to stop for a break. Otherwise, they'll start complaining soon. No, 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 I thought we were going to take a break. Obviously in German. No, I, I'm not going to even attempt it. I thought we were going to take a break. That was German, wasn't it? Ninety of the K to go. Better. We come out here to overtake and uh, end up with a P place. When we go into a break in German, van machen wir pause. There is a P place. There's a P place. P place coming up. Place for a P. We just 
dive back over all three lanes again. Obviously, you knew that, Crispy. You didn't Google it or anything. You just knew it. Right, stopping to pee. <laughs> Have we got a place to... There isn't any parking places. Okay, we'll just do a... Uh, right, open the doors. I love that noise. Uh, right, take a break. Have a Kit Kat. I could have gone a bit next to the sign. I'll just go here instead. Right. Oh, no, don't sit down, you stupid fool. I'm trying to shoot people. Right, you. You. Three. Uh, four, five. Six. There's navigation broken. We've been for a break. Stop moaning. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. I can count on everything. Twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Checked passengers. Yay! Right. Oh, vehicle into Neutralis. Right, go, 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 go. On to Rostock. Alle Straßen führen nach Rom, aber diese nicht. All roads lead to Rome, but this one doesn't. What? It doesn't even make sense as a sentence. Well, it does, but we're nowhere near Rome. What? Why would you say that? Right, 65k. to Bergen. I can ban you, you know. So we will go through the leaderboard of shame at the end of this. So those people that are friends with me on Steam and have this game will be shamed. Oh, yeah, I forgot the whole reason for being off today was the whole Jubilee thing. It feels like a Saturday for me. I've done all my normal Saturday type things today. Your brain is as confused as normal well, as to what day of the week it is. It definitely, although my alarm went off this morning, well, I was awake before it, I woke up at quarter past five because it was too bright. Um, and I was in the supermarket at 10 to 7. It just feels like a Saturday. So tomorrow is going to feel like another Saturday. Then we got a Saturday, then we got a Sunday. It's, I'm just going to be really confused. I've been caught speeding. Hast du den Blitzer gesehen? There, there was a little bit of speeding there. Some, some speeding happens. A bit like Groundhog Day. Yeah, it is. Yesterday definitely felt like a Friday. Which is why it was confusing doing train sim. It's like, why were there train sim on a Friday? And this is the sort of thing I would do on a Saturday lunchtime. So this is well, no, because that's Trains in World Two now. See, I don't, I haven't got a clue. Um, 
Right, 30k to go to arrive in Rostock. Oh, we've got to come off here. We just, we just dive off at the exit. Definitely a bit of the speedy going on. So recovering a bit of uh, good ground. I was concerned that this would actually take a long time. Which wouldn't have been a bad thing, I suppose. So you've got to come back down this road after you've been into uh, Rostock. Phone's ringing. Phone's definitely ringing. Shouldn't really be out in this lane. I don't know which way we're going to be going when we get into the uh, Rostocks. So that's what we're in. A Seikan. There's a Seikan R900 next to me. What's... That's definitely a Seikan R900. Uh, my work phone's on loud all the time. My personal phone, the last time it actually rang. I think I got a text message back in March. Oh no. A week ago, then I got a text message. <laughs> Whilst on the stream. Uh, my my work phone is set to uh, go off. Hey, that's my blitzer. Uh, go on silent at quarter past five, Monday to Friday. And of course, it's been beeping this morning as people have been emailing me. I've actually got to do some work after the stream. And then it'll go off, off. Come on, lights. Ponto boy. I'm actually indicating really early. I had a feeling they were going to change then. Yeah, I, we go, I do some work with Heathrow Airport and they don't shut. So uh, I'm expecting some stuff to come through. So I need to do that this afternoon. And then it will go off. Yeah, it's showing intentions early, but so there's people that indicate a long time before a turning. So they end up going past one turning and then stop at another. It's like, wait, no, you indicate that after you've gone past the turning before the one you want to go off at. And of course you get certain drivers that just don't indicate at all.
those are the people that drive at 30 and a 50. There's a dual carriageway that runs down the side of Swindon that's 70 miles an hour, which is the speed limit on a dual carriageway, unless marked otherwise. And uh, Kate came up it the other week, up the in, doing, going up the inside lane, doing 70 miles an hour, some dithering old idiot in a 05 plate Corsa was poodling along, doing about 40, 45. Gets to work, goes in, dumps a bag, goes back outside, uh, sees that same dithering old idiot uh, pull into the car park, and it was um, one of the guys that worked there. And so, of course, I had to go and say to him, I came up with your carriageway just now and got stuck behind a dithering old idiot plodding along doing 45 miles an hour. He went, oh, yes, an old car. It's a 70 mile an hour road. You're causing a danger by doing 45. Yeah, it's only 1.2. So you're telling me it doesn't do 70? Well, it probably would. Then do 70. Or don't go on the draw carriageway. Anyway, you're going to kill. There is your ticket. Thank you. And you. You are right there. You're going to Schwerin. Well, tractors can't do 70. And they've got, you know, flashing lights and stuff. So, you know, those you can uh, accept, but not idiots in a Corsa. Yeah, I got a choice in my work phone uh, of having the work phone, using it for my own personal calls, personal texts, and just giving up my personal phone. No, I have two phones, so I can turn the, turn the work phone off. Uh, right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard the Simpson Stuff Flixbus Travel Service going to Schwerin, Kiel and Flensburg. On the side of the coach, it does say a bonus to arrive alive, and trust me, it probably will be. In the seat back pocket in front of you, you will find our next of kin card. If you kindly fill out the details of your next of kin on that card, we'll know who to contact in the event of your untimely death on this journey. If you also like to fill out any usernames, credit card numbers, PIN numbers, passwords, etc., we'll make use of those as well. For your convenience, we have already ticked the Simpson Stuff life insurance box, and whenever you do, don't read a small print. Right. Close that. Click on start your ride. So after swearing, we've got to take another break. Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. Ja, yeah, after fill one out. Im Bus gilt die gesetzliche Anschnallpflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. In den Sitztaschen I haven't got any next of kin though. Unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut's doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. <lacht> yeah. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Hier, ist ein Car und ein PC. Kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den oh, wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. 
We're glad to have you on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seatbelts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seatbelt fastened throughout the entire journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and <coughs> details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Well, finally set off being we left about you know, a few minutes ago. So Schwerin is our next stop, 143k. And after that, we've got to take uh, another pee break. You're going to let me out? No, you're not going to let me out. Thanks for that. Wow, that scenery as far as the scenery it goes. I, you can see the scenery as far as the scenery is. That's that's the thing. Oh, 80. That's fine. We're not doing that. So back down that same road that's being built. It's a lot of people getting phone calls and texts and things. Yeah, I definitely miss this. So if it did have that economy system, I think it would be a lot more playable. Same goes for um, ETS2. When we get a proper proper um, uh, virtual trucking company thing for ETS2, I think that uh, that's something I'll be doing a lot more of. If and when it happens, hopefully we get it this year. All right, back to a hundred limit. Although there's a hundred limit through most of those roadworks as well. Half tank of fuel. We're okay on fuel. Right, power all of the flat outs all the way towards Schwerin. And then we got Kiel and Flensburg after that. run through that leaderboard of shame at the end. Phone. That phone's ringing. just so relaxing this you know albeit there's no actual you know aim for it 
initially, you know, you can go around as I did and unlock every city. So that gives you plenty to do. The driving from one to the other. So that's it's quite a lot of gameplay just doing that. Obviously, you want to get all the vehicles, ideally. Although, if DLCs aren't your thing, the actual standard MAN cut, well, that's a thing. The world's largest caravan. Uh, the standard MAN coach is uh, is really nice. That was a really out of scale caravan. anything with it someone said about doing some more of the football DLC uh, I like the football DLC it's great from a having to do something from an economy point of view but it is just all motorway driving and a lot of it you end up driving back from some of the games at night so you're doing motorway driving at night which is fine from a gameplay point of view and from a DLC point of view but from a stream point of view not ideal Which is why I started at 6 a.m. in this, so we saw the sun come up. Um, it should still be daylight, hopefully, by the time we arrive at our destination. Oh, yeah. Uh, Trix Mott, or Trix M O T. Uh, thanks very much for the follow. Welcome to Insanity. So, yeah, back tonight with some farming. Uh, before there becomes a change to the way uh, farming is going to carry on. Uh, tomorrow lunchtime, got some flights, taking the BAE 146 on a flight from Innsbruck back to the UK. Providing I can turn the autopilot on this time. Um, tomorrow night is going to be some Forza Horizon 5 in multiplayer. Saturday lunchtime is some Train Sim World 2 on the Harlem line. Saturday night is still to be uh, decided. And uh, Sunday lunchtime, some truck and logistics sim. Yeah, cheers, confused. Catch you soon. Which is my favourite bus sim, Omzi. That's really the only bus sim. Right, 50k to go. <laughs> no, phone's ringing. Phone, there's definitely the phone ringing there. <laughs> Come on, lights. So we're due at 11, no, we're due at 1.30 into Schwerin, which is 48 kilometers away. It's currently 11.32. So we're actually going to be early. Which is fine. I can't remember what the distances are between uh, these last two stops. But yeah, it's definitely my favourite coach range, the Scania. I do like them. Scania trucks, Scania coaches. I can't see I've got any uh, strong thoughts on Scania buses because there's only the ones really in OMSI. I can't recollect them being really sort of stand out compared to any of the others. Left turn towards Schwerin and we got a light that is green. We like that. We like the green lights.
Close ring in. So we've got to come back down this road on the way out again. that carries you off, it's the coffin they carry you off in. Right, 18k away. Oh, of course, speeding again. Hang on, there's a hundred limit, apparently, on that bit of road. Still showing there's a hundred limit. I wasn't doing a hundred. Why have you done me for the speeding thing? Mm -hmm. Okay, straight on here. We're we'll definitely going through the town. Blimey. Who knew Schwerin was so big? Perfectly timed green light. Fly me and place still goes on. Hi oh, Blinky. Hope you're doing okay. And straight in there, Blinky. Thank you very much, my longest um, subscribing person. 49 months. Thank you very, very much, uh, Blinky, for your support over all these years. It is very much appreciated. I hope you are doing okay. And family is all uh, doing better. We have missed you. We need to take the mickey out of an Australian. Right, stop is up here. Good. Uh, so we go past the duchy on the left hand side. No, past the stop. In there. Bones ringing. Bones definitely ringing. Yeah, they're definitely, definitely ringing. I'm going to get twatted by a bin lorry. Those bin lorries are definitely new. They just drove over the curb. Right, have arrived in the Schwerin place. Right, uh, you. Sorry, a bit close. Keel, yeah, go in a keel. Uh, you. Why? Is he going to 
Flensburg. Am I going there? Oh, yes, the final stop. Yep, yeah, that's where we're going. You? Yep. Go in there. Uh, you want to buy a ticket. To Laurelie. I'm not going to Laurelie. Sod off. Uh, you? Flensburg. They're all good. And that's it. Okay, I'm just going to close this dot. Thank you. Coming through. Should, should you, you, you people not got places to go or anything? No? Okay. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard the Sims and Stuff Flixbus Travel Service going to Kiel and Flensburg. Uh, on the side of the coach, it does say a bonus to arrive alive, and based on this drive, it probably will be. Uh, in the seat back pocket in front of you, you'll find our next of kin card. If you kindly fill out the details of your next of kin on this card, we'll know who to contact in the event of your untimely death on this journey. If you also like to fill out any usernames, credit card numbers, PIN numbers, passwords, etc., we'll make use of those as well. For your convenience, we have already ticked the Simpsons stuff life insurance box, and whatever you do, don't read the small print. That one. Right, sit thee down. Close the door. So we've got to take a break between here and Kiel again. Okay, wait for this lorry to go past. Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, um, hier ein paar through. Hinweise. Auch bei uns im Bus gilt die gesetzliche Anschnallpflicht. Bitte schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack- und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen? No, it doesn't say that. Viele unserer Sitze sind it mit says, Steckdosen ausgestattet. Nor do we ensure that your body will be disposed of in an so ethical manner. Die gesamte Fahrt übernutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. We're glad to have you on board and that we yes, close. you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seatbelts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seatbelt fastened throughout the entire journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet, sounds like a deal, charge, Pontevoy. Simply log on to our online. We'll bring some packages over. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets, which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. I had a vision in my head then of um, the Monty Python bit. Bring out your dead! He's not dead. <laughs> I won this. Good luck with customs. It's a lifelike mannequin. Starting to smell a bit. <laughs> 
super queue. I bet there is today as well, lots of them. Never seen so many burger buns and hot dog buns and fresh burgers and all sorts when I was in the supermarket at like 10 to 7 this morning. It's a glorious day as well here. There's lots of people having the BBQs. Phone's ringing. Definitely the phone ringing. Yeah, definitely ringing. So we've got Kiel and Flensburg to go for our cross the top of the map adventure ends. We've got to take a break between here and Kiel. And then at the end, I will go through the leaderboard of shame. Those people that are friends with me on Steam and have this game, uh, if they're lower down in the ranking than me, will be shamed. If they're higher up in the ranking than me, they'll be ignored. Quite rightly so. Yet neither have I, Crispy. <laughs> it's the first time I've played it since I last checked it. So there's no fear of you being above me then. It's a real shame because it is such a really, really good game. Uh, it's running a lot smoother. It's been optimized well. You know, the, the visuals are great. The graphics are, uh, are great. The sounds really good. It's just really needs an economy system. Just give it an economy system, and this would be uh, really, really good. So yeah, in the lovely little Scania 121. Yeah, that's what I said, isn't it? Initially, when you get the game, yeah, you want to unlock every every city. Um, you know, we're up here, Schwerin, heading up to Kiel and then Flensburg. So we've gone across the top here. You know, the standard map's really big. I've got all the map DLCs, so it adds in Paris. You know, so there's a lot of map. You know, this is really, you know, multiplayer in this would be so good. Um, and so initially, if you got it, unlocking every city because you can't you can't start a, a, a city or town until you've been there so it means that you've got to start you know if you set your start location as hanover you can only start hanover until you say go to wolfsburg and unlock wolfsburg then next time you can start from wolfsburg so initially it gives you stuff to do to unlock every place in the map but once you've done that then it's like okay now what so that's the bit then where you go now what do I do? And because there hasn't been enough DLC and it's not a constant, you know, it's not like in ETS 2 where every couple of months you've got a new map, a new truck, a new thing that keeps it fresh, keeps it interesting. Um, or like Train Sim, that every week there's something new. Um, you haven't got that with this. So there's nothing that really draws you back to it. Whereas an economy system or multiplayer, I think would certainly do that. I think this would be great fun in multiplayer. Just doing a, a coach convoy. Because it was on their list uh, when I was part of the beta team. Multiplayer was on the list of things for Fernbus. If every other game can do it it can't be that hard surely so we've got 150k to go to Kiel we've got to stop for a break before then so if we don't find a place before we get to say the 100k to go then we'll uh, just pull over at the side of the road like we did last time and then get off and have a pee up a tree or in a bush. Uh, 
going to do to Right, left turn ahead. I really like the dynamic seasons in this as well. I've got it turned off for this one because I didn't want to end up being it just rainy or anything. So I've got it set to summer. But I normally keep it in a dynamic season. So depending on what time of the year you're playing, that's the weather you'll get. So when I used to do weekly videos in this, I love the winter because the snow in this just looks so good. Alright, let's go for the overtakey. See if we can find a P place. I'm sure there'll be one. Yeah, there's definitely new vehicles in this now. So they are still updating it. They are still working on it. to the right hand side come on we need a P okay so 100 oh, I don't get much chance to slow down today 120 180 60. Tunnel! Although the actual speed limit on the uh, on the nav is still saying 80. Well, he's not doing 60, is he? Flipping Flix bus driver. K to go. So we definitely need to find somewhere to have a pee. I don't really want to pull up on the hard shoulder. Uh, there's a truck facing the wrong way. That didn't go well for him then. Or her. Them. Interesting colour. Okay, coming off here. Oh, already in the lanes, turn right. No need to do the indicatory thing. Although the car in front was doing the indicatory thing as well. Come on, we need a P. Opti petrol. Okay. So I'll answer the phone.
I'm... Yeah, I don't, it just feels wrong. If, well, you shouldn't do it. Pull over on the hard shoulder for a break. So I'll have to wait till we come off this motorway. And then I'll find somewhere to stop. Slight bit of undertaking. American styley. Okay, now we're going incredibly slowly. Why you go so slow? Yeah, the rear wheels on trailers in this have never looked good. It's got that sort of blurred image to make it look as though they're going round, but they're not. And they're also off the ground as well. That's a thing. So is it the person in the minibus then, up in front, or the van that's going slow? Come on, we've got to be coming off soon. Or we need a P place soon. One of those. One of the two will be fine. I don't mind which one. Come on, you can do it. I usually, I, I, well, there were words there. Uh, I looked down and thought, oh, 80, that's not bad. Of course, 80 kilometers an hour, which is actually quite slow. 100 kilometers an hour, 60 miles an hour. So even the trucks in front should be able to do close to 100 kilometers an hour. Yeah, they're not. They're dithering along at uh, 70, which I'm now also doing. Right, if I hopefully overtake now, what's the bet in my exit come up? It's a nice new bit of road. It even sounds smooth. If that's a thing. <coughs> now we go for fuel. Yeah, plenty of fuel. Right, AI didn't get too confused there by the merge. That's good. We need to take a break. I know we need to take a break. I'm trying to find somewhere to take a break that isn't just you know, on the side of the hard shoulder. And now I can't pull off here because there's a barrier in the way. So I need to find somewhere suitable to be able to pull over and take the break. We're only 28 kilometers from Kiel. We were due at Kiel at 16.17. It's currently 13.50. So we are ahead of time. But this barrier just never ends. That you cannot, you will not go off road. We will not allow it. You will stay on the highway. I am just putting over and against town, aren't I? I think that's going to be the thing. Twenty k away. We've got a right turn coming up.
Oh, moving. And stopping again. So once we've been to Kiel, we've only got Flensburg to go. And then our journey across the top of the map, which is so we started off over here in Albeck, uh, went up to Selin, back down to Rostock, Rostock down to Schwerin, Schwerin up here to Kiel, where we nearly are, and then it'll be Kiel up to Flensburg. So uh, across the top bit of the map, all the journeys we've done last few months have been sort of down here in Vienna. Uh, we did some stuff down over here, I think. Uh, we've been down in France recently. So I thought, mm, they've really got the top of the map. So that's what we've done for this one. But we've got 13 kilometers to go to get to Kiel. We've got to take a break before then. Phone's ringing. Definitely a phone's ringing. Yep, that's that's hundred percent ringing. Is lights ever going to change? Oh, yes. do a thing. Sie sollten mehr auf ihr Navi gucken. Well, you want to take a break for your people? A nice area to take a break then. Nice put a few trees around, bit of grass. Right, take a break. Get your kit cut out. Right, so now we've got to check all the passengers back in. Let's go and close this door. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Hang on, I missed one. How have I missed one? Who have I missed? Got you. Got you. You. There we go. All passengers checked. Sit thee down. Close the door. Put into gear. No, that's that one. That one. Right. Into keel. Brake taken. Definitely a lot of coffee people and not people that like coffee. Because those are also coffee people. They could be you could be a coffee coffee person. Uh, where are we going now? Straight on. Around there. Green for me. The Rona Express, yeah. Uh, we got to do a lefty turny play. Oh, that's green. That's green for me. We like that. Get in shape and be healthy. No. I won't. I refuse. So straight on here. Oh god, what a horrible colour that van is. And go. <laughs> okay, then left up here. Uh, 
get in shape, be healthy, die anyway. Exactly. Live life, be happy. It may be short of life, but you'll be happy. Rather than drinking the juice of a ground up carrot and some broccoli every morning. Come on. Uh, why would you use a mouse for stick? Okay. I think you can just use, you can still use um, keyboard for accelerate and brake. I think you can then use a mouse for steering, but use an Xbox controller. It's so much better. Coming through. Old habits. Blimey. I think I've ever used a mouse of steering in any game. Uh, what are we doing now? That one, that one. Right. Uh, you. You are right. We're going to Flensburg. You. Yep. Uh, going to Flensburg. And you. Yep. You're good. Uh, you, you in there? Yep, you're good. You. You want to buy a ticket to the Flensburg? Flensburg, that place. Okay. You're good. I'm not Alf Gates, but okay. You. You can buy a ticket to the Flensburg. No problem at all. Uh, you down there. Yep, could you be a smartphone? Uh, you? Yep, you're good. And you over there on your phone. Yep. Uh, that's everybody. Close that. Close that. Okay, the final one then. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard this Sims and Stuff Flixbus travel service going to Flensburg. On the side of the coach, it does say a bonus to arrive alive. Uh, and it probably will be. And a seat back pocket in front of you, you'll find our next of kin card. If you kindly fill out the details of your next of kin on that card, we'll know who to contact in the event of your untimely death on this journey. If you also like to fill out any usernames, credit card numbers, PIN numbers, passwords, etc., we'll make use of those as well. For your convenience, we have already ticked the Simpson stuff life insurance box, and whatever you do, don't read the small print. Okay then. Set ourselves down, close that door, click on start right, and off to Flensburg we go. Hallo und herzlich willkommen bei Flixbus. Wir freuen uns, dass ihr an Bord seid und wir gemeinsam unser heutiges Reiseziel ansteuern. Bevor wir richtig in Fahrt kommen, hier ein paar Hinweise. That seemed well rehearsed. I've been giving that same speech for the last, what, four years? Schnallt euch deshalb während der gesamten Fahrt an. In den Sitztaschen vor euch findet ihr unsere Bordkarte mit weiteren Sicherheitshinweisen und Infos zu unserem Snack- und Getränkeangebot. Eine Toilette befindet sich im hinteren Einstiegsbereich. Wer kostenlos surfen will, wählt sich einfach in unser WLAN-Netz ein. Unser Reisetipp fürs Internet? Schaut doch mal auf unserer Facebook-Page vorbei. Unser Team freut sich riesig über eure Likes und Nachrichten. Sollte euer Akku zu Neige gehen? Kein Problem. Viele unserer Sitze sind mit Steckdosen ausgestattet und entsprechend gekennzeichnet. So könnt ihr euer Smartphone die gesamte Fahrt über nutzen. Wenn ihr eure nächste Fahrt auch gleich mobil buchen wollt, holt euch einfach unsere App und profitiert von exklusiven Online-Angeboten. Auf flixbus.de stehen täglich brandaktuell alle Infos und Städteverbindungen für euch bereit. Natürlich wollen wir unseren Service ständig weiter verbessern. Für Feedback zu eurer Fahrt nutzt bitte den Fragebogen, den wir euch per E-Mail zuschicken. Wir danken für eure Aufmerksamkeit und wünschen eine entspannte Fahrt und viel Spaß an Bord bei Flixbus. Hello and welcome to Flixbus. 
We're glad to have you on board and that we can get you to your favorite destination today. Before we set off, we would like to share some information about the journey. The wearing of seatbelts is compulsory on board the bus. Therefore, please keep your seatbelt fastened throughout the entire journey. In the seat pocket in front of you, you will find our information card containing further safety instructions and details of our snacks and beverages. There is a restroom located in the rear boarding area. If you would like to browse the internet free of charge, simply log on to our onboard Wi-Fi network. If your battery runs out, no problem. Many of our seats are equipped with power outlets, which are marked accordingly. If you would like to book your next journey while you're on the road, simply download our app onto your smartphone so you can take advantage of our many exclusive online discounts. For more information, simply visit flixbus.com or get in touch with us on Facebook. Of course, we're always striving to improve our service. Please use the questionnaire we send you by email to give us feedback about your journey. You can also use it to share your suggestions, ideas and requests. We are always ready to assist. And now, we can finally set off. Thank you for listening. We hope you have a relaxing journey and enjoy traveling with Flixbus. Indeed, relaxing journey, 112k to our final destination. So and then we will go through the leaderboard of shame. It actually worked out quite well, because you know, I just picked some destinations. I didn't have a clue how long it was going to take. Um, actually, not too bad, time-wise. <laughs> quite an enjoyable journey so far. Yeah, I do forget how well this thing runs now. And how good it looks. And how good this Scania sounds. Just get a slight bit of turbo whistle. Quite pleasant. Looks like another new bit of road being built there. I wonder if that'll end up in the game. Cut out that corner probably that we just went through. So we won't have to do this to go between these two places. I wonder if that's actual roads that are being done. That'd be quite cool. Laurie can get past there. There we go. Oh, wait for the van. It's quite a nice coloured van, actually. Bit of a dual totem thing going on there, look. Shame about the wheels. Very uh, Mercedes AMG wheels. countryside now. That's some flashing. Yeah, that's where that bridge is going to come through then. So eventually I think that road will link up to this. So you won't have to go through that junction that I've just been through. You'll come straight over that bridge. What how long it be before that's implemented in the game? Oh, 
82k to go. Due to arrive in Flensburg at 18.06, our current time is 15.06, so we are going to arrive early. We may have slightly left some passengers behind along the way, because we obviously arrived and departed from each location early. Oops. It'll be fine, they can get the next one. Very dinky fire engine. Yeah, definitely improved the AI. All right, straight run now, all the way to Flensburg. So this is a bit that's actually quite relaxing with firm bus. So it's a completely, you know, it's not the same as OMSI where you're just round town and stuff. It's actually quite nice just chilling on these bits of motorway or carriageway, etc. So it's what an actual coach driver would be doing. They spend all their time on the motorway. Yeah, it's true. They've definitely done something with the AI. They are still making improvements to this. Yeah, speaking of police cars. I didn't indicate. Tut tut tut. Nothing worse in real life is there if you're being followed by a police car. Even though you know, you know, cars taxed, insured, MOT'd, you're driving within the speed limit. You still become very nervous when you got a police car behind you. Typical, we want to turn right, and the road's blocked by those people turning left. Lovely, thanks for that. Should make this righty turny lane any bigger. Right, 24k to go, and we have arrived. A lighting issue, keep getting those bits of lighting just sort of flicking in. So that's still something they need to work on. And a bit of lag there that caused me to crash into the barrier. That's what I'm blaming anyway.
Oops. Yeah. Gerade geblitzt? Yeah, a little bit of speeding, just that might have happened. Awesome, Pontevoy. That's really cool. Obviously, just check the spec of it. Make sure it will uh, run all the games you want to play. Obviously, your games your brother might play might be different to the ones you want to play. Things like this can actually be quite demanding. Things like MSFS can be quite demanding. So, just check the spec. We had someone in the community a couple of years ago that bought a gaming PC that was um, sold as a gaming PC because it will run Fortnite. Yeah, that's a whole different thing. So yeah, the world of PC gaming is completely different to console gaming. So people sometimes come unstuck when they move from console to PC. They think they can just go into a game, sh a PC shop, and just buy a PC, but don't realise that unfortunately it's not that simple. But yeah, hopefully it does uh, everything you want it to do. You can do some proper gaming. Okay, cool little cobbled street. Yeah, console gaming is simpler, and I started out console gaming uh, before I uh, moved to PC gaming. Um, and that's what gives. Uh, that's why I'm really glad stuff like this and you know, other sim games are available on console because it gets people into sim gaming, um, and that's just brilliant. How am I going down there? <laughs> well, I just hope you enjoy it, Bonterboy. The full schedule. And there we go. We are up. They got off quicker than they. they got off quicker than me. World's keenest passengers. Uh, so we arrive in uh, Flensburg. Flensburg. Uh, which is looking rather nice. Look at the brightly coloured stuff here, isn't it? Anyway, right. Let's end. And we'll go through the uh, leaderboard of shame. See how we did. So, passengers transported, 41 out of 41. Tickets sold, 4 out of 4. Stops completed, 6 out of 6. Contact with Central, 5 out of 5. Drove 815 kilometers. Arrived on time, departed early. Uh, didn't lose anything for resting, qu resting quality. Uh, Pontoboy, thank you very much for the bits. Uh, restroom clearance was fine, reading light clearance was fine, Wi-Fi clearance was fine, passenger compartment lighting was fine, air conditioning was fine. Uh, announcement played five out of five times. Uh, maintain driving time, maintain work time, properties damaged five. But done for speeding four times. That's not so good, is it? Uh, drove on the road 92.8% of the time. A little bit of off-roading. Uh, speed limits were maintained 95% of the time and safety distance broken 15 times. Did get a little bit close tonight let's go back to the main menu then and check out that leaderboard of shame so my ranking 593 the top 100 
is never going to be a thing, is it? My friends are listening. So Alan's ahead of me. Ed is just ahead of me. 800 XP ahead. Uh, below me, though, uh, Sonic 593. Uh, 1881 is Dylan. At 2485 is Amy Lou. At 2668 is Ethan. At 3493 is Orange Boy. At 5784 is the other Dylan. At 5814 is Chris Brown. At 5946 is Don Rado. 6580 is Tux. 6867 is Kerry. Uh, 10,190 is Trent. 18,553 is Larwood. 19,911 is Michael. 20,204 is Peanut. 22,586 is The Hillsman. 23,102 is Blinky. 49,203 is Crispy. Uh, 94,655 is Noz. Uh, 122,470 is Liam. And 146,055 is Taken, who played the game once, didn't get very far. How are these people... How have they not played it that much? They should be ashamed. Uh, but there we go. We will come back and do some more firm bus again in the future um, and some tourist bus before then. So there we are. Uh, so thanks to you lot in chat for your uh, company for the last couple of hours. Uh, next stream for those watching live, because no one's got this far on YouTube, uh, is back in four hours time for some farming. Our last farming in the current format. Uh, and back tomorrow lunchtime for some flights in MSFS taking the BAE 146 on a flight from Innsbruck back to the UK, hopefully. Uh, tomorrow night, some Forza Horizon 5 in multiplayer. Uh, Saturday lunchtime, some Train Sim World 2, looking at the Harlem line. Saturday night, still to be decided. Uh, Sunday lunchtime, some Truck and Logistics. There's been a mega update for that. Uh, so looking forward to that one. So uh, thanks to this lot as well. Thanks to Potterboy for the bits, to uh, Blinky, Dylan, uh, Larwood and Nightbot for doing no moderation, to Trix and Drax for following, Richard and Blinky for subscribing. Uh, thank you very, very much indeed. I will be back in four hours' time for some farming. Until then, if you have been, thanks very, very much for watching. <laughs>